Lintan Studio. I'd show you guys the, uh, the intro, I guess. Hey guys, Bubble Knight here. Let's just go to uh, where we left off. Thank you guys for also pointing out this series. This seems like a really uh, awesomely short game. Read the current archive? Yes. Looks like it. Yep. Told, just told you once, but I remember them clearly. You girls are cool. You girls are cool. You girls are cool. That's probably the most uh, corny pickup line I've seen. You girls are cool. Eh, maybe someone be like me at that time, but no one spoke out to me actually. I told you people hated me since I entered middle school. <laughs> I went to Jenshan's apartment in the days at night. I was fired. Oh man. She opened the door. Apparently, she came out of the washing room and she wore pajamas. Drying her hair with a towel. Ooh, I can picture the scene. She a little embarrassed that I was crying her chest like a child. She acted as a mother, saying there's nothing wrong, but touching his head gently when he acted like a spoiled child. After crying for a while, I told her everything about what I had suffered these times. I was arrogant, and now I realized that nobody. I didn't do anything except for that. Well, I had no idea whether I have a value to survive this world. But Jinshun told me that I had to survive even this hard. Because I'm the only reason that supports her to live. Oh, man. Well, maybe, but I'm not the one I used to be. She just smiles, hold me arm in arm. I'm arrogant, don't you mind being with me? But you know me well with self centered and arrogant. Man, so all you have to do is be arrogant and self-centered to get a nice girl like her? Dude. Dude! Nobody told me that while I was in high school. Is that a mission? Is that Alright. I gave up. You win. Well, what do you want? In a way, I secretly hope I'm Yushan because 
she's such a nice girl. Spend my whole life with you from the moment a girl tells you this sentence. If you don't hate her or you like her, then you don't need to worry about how to respond to her correctly. The one thing you need to do is try your best to give her happiness. Perhaps these are what she wants to tell me. I think so, but it may be smelly without cleaning in the holiday. Oh shit. Ah, sure. Salsa. When you got close to toilet, the first word, her arms quivered. Although we already know the condition will be bad, but consider the worst situation. She's still walking in sight, determinedly, and I step on the school case slowly. Somehow I knew she would appear. You again! When I reach out the school gate, I see the strange man in the this morning again. The hell? She said with a worried smile on her face. We meet again! It was surprised me that our conversation started at her answer about what I asked this morning. I was surprised actually, but I confirmed she had no problem in the mental. Maybe she just lost her memory. But I still have confusion because she realized something wrong only after I asked her who she was. Did we know each other? I didn't tell the answer, but she gets the answer from my wordless in embarrassment. Nope, it's a little different. Eh, wait, hold on. I think the music's a little too loud. There. May sounds better. Try to move my eyesight from her face and explain it's different between us. I suddenly find out what's wrong with her. The uniform from a high school student. Yeah, she's a uniform from a high school student. But it's summer holiday now. There's no extra curriculum at Tanya school. Then why is she wearing the uniform in a bad breath bad breath ability on such a hot day? Yunshan. Oh shit, I'm caught. Ah! Suddenly a voice breaks my mind, just she's back from the toilet and walks to me. She lifts her tiptoe and, and looks through my shoulder to a direction where the maintenance stands. Shaking her head, she looks to me. Who am I talking to? I'm talking to... When I turn around and intend to show her the maintenance in the uniform, I find nobody there. <gasps> Can, uh, is this person he's imaginary? I start to uh, wonder. What? What happened? She is here just now. Yunshan. Okay, fine. Although the hero's sun is not reduced from at all this morning, I don't believe Yao may not produce illusion because of sunstroke. It's constantly knocking on my nerves without knowing my foundation of intuition. A variety of phenomena cannot be explained. In my conscious mind, Pointing to one possibility. Maybe, maybe that girl's a ghost? Nope, I think you mentioned in her. But well, for some reason, to know me gets well along with me. Mm, the watermelon girls here are especially sweet. Yushan especially like eating his childhood. Bring back a few, bring a few back if you like. It should be hard to find watermelon like, like this in the city. Mm. In the evening, we stay with mom to enjoy the cool in the edge of the yard. Even if no air conditioner, we can enjoy a summer night here away from the city. The watermelon fan. Chair. Open the windows, no need to pay the expensive electric bills will buy an expensive air conditioner. Only these, which can relieve a person free from heat of the whole day. This might be one of the convenient convenience in rural area when compared to in the city with this with the city. Throw in the night besides us, some restless mosquitoes perk out beside the cool. The hell? There's even a hot problem magician who's eating watermelon while she's splitting spool happy the mosquito easily. She said you you're quite awesome. 
<laughs> nali, nali. She's making a joke with mom innocently, and there are some dead mosquitoes scattered on the room and the yard floor. Actually, you're a monster, right? I have not seen who can grab mosquito with toes and eat watermelon. What? The remarks are used to the switch. What? Wait, what? What? Is she is she slapping the mosquito with her toes or her feet? Indeed. Your relationship is really good. When will you get married? When we are in, in attentive, immersed in the world with Jinshin. Suddenly I turn back to find my mom's looking at us with her meaningful eyes. Mom! Why do I feel it's not simple to call me back at this time? And not just let me relieve boredom. Because I wasn't expecting they would bring such a nice girl back with you. I started to feel bad regretting bringing Jinshin here. What are you talking about? Do you want to keep it a secret? Let, let me know with such a good girlfriend? But you asked me all this time from the beginning to meet Jinshun! Such a good girl becomes your girlfriend. How can I not be nervous? <laughs> when I brought Jinshun to say hi to the neighbors, they all started stare at her at the same time. They say they couldn't see such a beautiful girl in the village. But are they still happy knowing Jinshun is my girlfriend? It's really our fortune that we can have such a daughter-in-law like Junshun. Mom abruptly changed the subject, and it seems that the truth is probably what I said. As what you say about the future, what if something happens between us, and then we break up? <gasps> what? You two, why don't you look at me with such a horrible eyesight? Am I saying something wrong? Junshun, even if I always love you, but you breaking up with Junshun. Junshun, you mean... No! I, I just made joke without thinking. Why are you so serious? Don't you have mis Mistress Elsa Shun? Uh, Yuan Shun? I thought I had taught you. No! In addition to Yuan Shun, who would like me before, so you are. You have to force me to say something like that. A knife stab myself, so that you can feel at ease now? What the hell is that mean? Jishan, the orange and refrigerator. Let us squeeze some juice to drink. Both of them both of them completely ignore my wrong eyes and tone. Standing up and then go to the kitchen. I left with a weary smile and sign, looking up to high lonely moon and the night nice sky from the yard. Okay, I seriously think there's something wrong with our main character here. She appear when they are not here. Just like an accident cross or a seems un a written secret. When I'm alone, a girl wearing a uniform telling you in high school is standing in the yard as she is here all the time, talking to me in a strange na natural tone. Ashley, are you a ghost? I go straight into the subject, and the girl in front of me without any slightest shake. She blinks her eyes, lifts her mouth, outlining the expression, You have felt me by the eye, refining features. Means that when I got back to you, you were still there. Ah, oh, crap. I'm very sorry. Knowing the fact she exists of a ghost, the girl's analyzing the present situation calmly rather than panic for that. Such a ghost like a human, perhaps it will make people change their attitude to others. So is it appropriate to explain that I can see you on the occasion without anyone else besides me? 
The girl sits beside me when she's talking. The ghost girl sits beside me at such a close distance I can almost touch, but I have no sense of fear, and also have no idea how to avoid her. Perhaps my instinct tell myself that she won't hurt me. It's really sweet burying those souls in the city. Huh? Absolutely. It may be the taste of home. The mechanical sound of the juicer comes from the kitchen. While I'm chatting with the ghost girl just like one of your friends. Have you said that you had remember everything about me, right? Don't you remember yourself when even though looking at your face? Such as using a mirror? Maybe she's really a ghost. A schoolgirl? Well, you're a pretty girl. You have a nice hourglass figure, long hair to the waist, and have charming, refined features. I'm so glad there's like no multiple choice feature, because I, I would have so screwed up this whole thing. The girl smiled rather weary. Really? It's true, I promise. Don't you trust me? The expression of the girl tells and sign that she is willing to trust me wholeheartedly. Alright, can I ask you a question? Do you remember when you appeared this way? It was over six years ago or even earlier? I must have seen you in a small town in the past. Maybe when I come back to this small town... It means that you become a ghost because of me? If it's just like what you said, the relation between us should be good. But why do I have no impression about you? That is sort of sad. Can I remember who you are if you find out the answer? Maybe that's her um, little sister, I'm thinking. Why is this? But Yunshan, Xinjiang's Chengji is here. Holy crap, woman! You just distracted me. You just like, huh? Here's a fresh orange juice. I was like, what? <laughs> okay, let's cook some fresh orange juice. The conversation is ended between me and the ghost, go, uh, ghost girl, distress, and Jishan bringing some orange juice in a plastic pot back with me. I expect, I expected the girl gets out of my sight, but she does not leave. Either can I see her nor hear her voice. In fact, the girl still sits at somewhere I can touch easily, looking at me in the eyes that never can be conveyed. Holy shit. Nope, fine. I take the cup past Wang Junshan. Huh, I completely remember everything about Junshan. Girls are always able to remember the name of her favorite person and everything about he was she as a whole life, even they heard only for once. The mix of the sour and sweet stimulant of my taste buds echo in words in my mind. Orange juice mixed with, with this peel, a rate of bitter, cannot be rejected in my mouth. The more I follow this line to think about, the more I'm afraid of knowing it. The answer waiting for me at the end of thinking. Maybe there's something 
the girl has told us people try to forget subconsciously. But no matter how to resist, my thoughts still cannot stop for a while. Perhaps I will find out the answer soon. At the time, what can I really know and what will I remember? Oh god. Yunshan. What? How's it going? Ah, you sure you may see my double from the Tiendo Dryang and Jala. Is she there, Alma? Maybe. Sure, you can see a number of fields handled today are much less than others. What she can't put to Lala. Are you tired? No, 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 after coming back from town, I will recover from the depression of being dismissed, and therefore I offer to help my mom today. Nevertheless, Jensha is not idler, and though it's not appropriate for me to say, but she probably wants to stay with, with me as far as possible, so she came here. Spending two or three hours at present nearly twelve o'clock, all the rest of the field belongs to my family are handled. While we're cleaning up the tools and watering, Jensha asks me such a question. Now it probably leaves four acres of land. Simu. Yep, four acres. One mu is how many acres? Pretty big. About six hundred and sixty-six square meters. 就是说，至少有两千四百平方米。Yep. Yep, right. 你们家原来也是有钱人啊，雨山。Nope. Not a grand house of twenty-four hundred square meters. Aren't you major in finance and trade the same with me? Why don't you understand the concept? 云善，你的意思是这些都是政府用地，只不过是租给你们家用来种菜 ？Yep, although we don't need to pay the rent, a part of the profits need to be handed over to government, and we cannot change the usage of the field. 既然是这样，阿姨为什么还要留这四亩地呢？利润不高，打理起来又累。Didn't you say you're not tired? And after my dad died, I told her many times, but she has reluctant to give up all the time. 难道是因为？ It's probably yet. The reason why she still reserves these fields takes care of even if she's alone. Jason got the answer in advance before I tell. I ought to say she's a D smart, right? No matter how I persuade her, my mom always say this is a large con concession she can do. See all this work in the field where his dad and I work together in the past. I will feel sick. I was rejected for this reason, and so I had no idea to say anything. 阿姨，真的是让人敬佩的女人呢、啊。You're right. She's not only a good mother, but also a nice wife. 我也能成为阿姨那样子的好妻子、好母亲吗 ？If you want, and maybe if you stay with other boys. 我揍你喽，女神。Sorry, sorry, just kidding. I will actually invite her to beat me up. I would mind. As long as it's Jenshin, she must be a woman no worse than my mom. I will always believe that sincerely. Fine, finish watering. Let's have a rest.、Mm. After I finish the day of work in the fields, I sit on the edge of the path. Jensha, who used to be clean and tidy all the time, is reluctant to, to the dirty path at the beginning. By the end, she sits with me. Maybe at the moment, Jensha made a fight in her thought. The people growing up in the city must be reluctant to sit on the dirt road like this. But for me, it's an extremely normal thing. 我现在有点明白为什么这里的建设工程被搁置，上级也没有继续做下去了。现在各地都在快速推进城市化，他们说不定是想让唐英镇保留着农村的风格，借此发展旅游业吧。You know, I wonder who's the voice actor. Maybe it's in the credits. It makes sense. Urbanization means that the number of rural area will be cut, but for the country, the arable land food are indi indispensable. Moreover, it's popular to experience natural from large city to countryside. 话说回来，云山， What? 大学刚认识你的时候，我有问过你，为什么会选金融专业吧？ Because I want money. Well, it seems to be such a good thing. 你说以后会告诉我，你结果直到六年后的今天。I'm pretty sure it's money. Oh, Jenshin, you can never, you can even remember trifles. 说过了吧，女孩子可是。Hmm. Yep, I know. 莫非你是为了有朝一日能回来接手唐英镇的建设工程吗 ？Well, the reason I chose finance, I 
thought I have a certain reason to choose finance as a major university so I can get a job related to finance. But now I consider it carefully, I really don't know why I chose this path. I'm absolutely sure that Junshin's words are very close to the reason I chose finance originally. I'll make a buck in the future. See? See what I told you guys. And then come back to take this construction project. At the time, let's get married. What? During trouble over, a blurred picture flashed through my mind in the voice of somebody. I suddenly realized it's my voice, but the flash of the picture is. Yu Shan. Yu Shan. What? You have any reason to be No? Nope, nope. Na ni do di shi wei shama la. Because. Okay, let's make a deal, you should. What? I forgot it. Huh? I'm so sorry, Jushin. It's long to. long ago to remember the reason I chose finance at the time. Jushin me ban fa. Kana wu yi zhi nan wang ji zhe dian shi la. I understand. My total max expression are able to hide to tell Jishin that I know the reason I chose this major Ashley. But even if she really knows this point, she still decided to give up pumping me about the case. Because I look like refusing to answer this question. I'm sorry, Jishin. I crazily shake my head to deny it. 也是,以雨善之前的那种性格,会喜欢上你的估计都是怪人吧。And you're one of them. It means that you're also a crank, yep. 我就是怪人呀,我可是喜欢在夜晚偷偷摸摸的刮腿毛的人哦。哇哈哈哈。Nice to know. Seriously, it seems that I should consider about splitting up with you. 你敢,你信不信今天晚上我就趁你睡着的时候把你的腿毛给刮了。Ah. Uh, I feel like I would like lose more than that. Something between your legs, perhaps? She could be one of those Yandera girls. You never know. Her eyes are pretty red already. Sorry, please forgive me. She must know I'm weird. After I accidentally put an awkward atmosphere into her conversation, Junshin takes away with her laughter. She's a tender hearted girl. Yoshin, Junshin, are you done? If you finish, let's go. Go back to cook. Uh, okay, sitting on the other side of the road, Jishin side by side. My mom's still standing there, putting her hands up to yell. The work of the field are work my mom after negotiating for several times come to an end. Cool. I couldn't I couldn't imagine like those rural area parents says cool. As an answer to, you know, oh, to younger kids. Come on. She just stretch out her left with a smile, pulling me up, patting me down the dust in my pants. Jesha holds me on an arm, who passed down the dust in her skirt just now. Uh, how about you? Don't you want to cook, Jesha? What about fried rice and scrambled eggs? Sorry, sorry, I believe you're cooking. And this is you make me won't be worse than my mom. On the way home, I chatted with my mom and Jenshin while thinking about problems after we come back to Tanyan Town in my mind. What confused me most is about the ghost girl. Me too! If she become the ghost girl because of allowing to see me again, then I can make sure two things. First of all, she died in literary meaning. Second, she and me were not already friends before she died. Maybe we were lovers or we were almost close to such an intimate relationship relation. My intuition tells me that the flash and the picture and sound which came across my mind have a connection with her. She's your sister, dummy. The uniform of high school. The day with someone. The reason of choosing my major, something very significant that I forgot by myself, and the reason and the answer is just one step away from me. However, I cannot reach the final only if I stretch my hands. But why I, my body cannot move uh, for my fear, for other reasons. But it, it's not. It's a good thing if you remember me. I'm recalling her words. 
。Oh God. Yep, what's going on? You <laughs> say today I found a very good chicken. I decided to make a chicken pie. Oh, that's nice. Huh. All right. Look at Joshua's warm smile. I seem to understand the meaning of some words from the ghost school. Recall the whole thing. Oh, that's long text. About the ghost, the result may not be only for myself, but my life will be will be destroyed if the relationship between us before she died no less than the relationship between me, between Jenshin and me. But it's better to remember. Hmm. 想起来什么 ？I mean, you should make it more delicious. 没问题，包在我身上。I have the responsibility, responsibility to recover the answer. I will crash, and my life will cra also crash. But I need to undertake the responsibility to know this answer. Otherwise, I cannot treat Junshin with a heart and soul. If I didn't come back to Chaoyuan Town, I might not face these problems. But even I did not come back this time, I will be back someday and get into this trouble as well. In this case, I can only choose to face it. Facing everything in the past and present. The hell is going on with her? In him? That night I had a dream. Nope, it's more period to say it's my memory I forgot. What the reality once existed in my life. Not like common dreams, unreal and hazy. The only difference is that I still remember everything clearly after I woke in. I don't recall any details of my dream, no matter how many days, months, or even years. That was so real. This must be because of the treasure. I cannot forget absolutely. Yun Shen, Dong Xiao, and Lao, why are you still studying? Shen Wei, calm down, Xia Bai. Oh shit! So it's not her sister, not his sister. I have no time to waste in the boring entertainment and topics. Lao, ah. Yep, boring. So if you have nothing urgent, do not bother me, okay? But, the boring entertainment and talk are all part of my life. Yun Shen. I was arrogant, self-righteous in my dream. I even had an idea what everyone's a fool except for me. Of course, a number of people were far away from me because of this bad character characteristic. Nevertheless, in this classroom or in this school, there's a strange maiden who was willing to talk to me. Although I could not see her appearance, but there's no doubt that she was the same person with the ghost, according to her voice. 每次考试都能拿到全年级第一，全市第十，是很值得高兴的事情吧？ My grade was not that great. 不过啊，偶尔放松一下也不是什么坏事啊。I see that Mei Ning cannot notice my cold and arrogant. What Ashlo was pretending, she showed her warm smile of sunshine, which can almost melt the iceberg. 怎么了 ？You're freak. Oh, that's just me. 嗯，陈教生气了。为什么这么说？ In the class or in the whole school, no one likes me. But you're willing to chat with me. 照这么说，你的意思是你也愿意跟我聊天的？ Girls are weird. The maiden smiled happily. 女生，你在做的不是老师布置的题吧？ Maybe. The maiden was trying hard to ask something I might be interested in, and rather than I disliked. Although I hated wasting my time on chatting games at that time, but she still remembered me. Still remembered making an effort to talk with me for nothing, so I chose to compromise. That girl, Yun Shen. Yep. There are some exercises I brought at the bookstore in the next town, and then I finished at school centers, but they are not enough to master knowledge and deep. We're in grade two. Now, you're not so nervous about learning so much, right? Go. Okay, so she say they were in a. I guess that's the equivalent of、uh, junior in high school. Is he gonna be so ner nervous now? If not, it's hard to keep up with the first rank in our grade or top ten in town. Look, she's talking with that guy. Really, that arrogant boy wouldn't like to talk with others in the same level. But maybe it's because of her. You're right. I think no one will like her in our school. He's a man, though he's arrogant, right? Ha ha! I was talking with the maiden, both cold and warm, continuously. It, it quickly drew my classmates' attention. As people who had high visibility in the bad aspect, I knew that maiden in front of me was 
in opposed to personality type. 云山，你除了学习之外，还有什么兴趣吗 ？Comics, video games, manga. It is interest of eating watermelons. Oh, what? <laughs> 你们家的院子一定很大吧 ？The house in town almost the same. 嗯，我不是唐英镇的人啊。有机会的话，我能到云山你的家里去玩吗 ？Perhaps. Oh, this. Okay. Okay. She was outgoing, a little dependent, but not annoying. She had long black hair. Black hair. <laughs> I am swear she had like some some sort of like a light green or light teal hair. Black hair. What the hell's wrong with you? I gotta I gotta message the author about this. Black hair. Refined facial ex,、uh, features, a nice figure. These made her very popular. From then on, the maiden always chatted with me after class every day. In the beginning, I disliked her for freaking showing up, but later I adopted to it. Long times later, I would feel like a fish out of the water when she did not come to me. Unconsciously, she had become indispensable to me. Therefore, on some day, I asked maiden a question by a sudden impulse. May I ask you a question? Uh, Yunshan, you 居然会主动问我事情呢？怎么了 ？Would you be my girlfriend? Why do you like talking with me? I didn't like to get in touch with people and things except for study. But even though I was a little arrogant, man, I knew myself. I shouldn't have friends, especially a nice, enthusiastic girl like her. That 当然是因为喜欢云山你啦 Without any warm up, any prelude, the maiden told me the answer just like the words for granted. 想要跟喜欢的人聊天。Nope, not at all. Like, like me? I was pretty much a fat otaku in uh in high school, so I uh I understand. Yeah. I've attracted、uh, attracted Kira to bad behavior, and all I can do is nothing apart from my study. I look down upon my you at the at the past. Why do you like me? Um, 一定要说的话。就是喜欢上了云山，你学习是认真的表情吧。She was not staring from what I said straightforwardly. On the contrary, her smile became more firm. You really a freak? 嗯，也许是吧。You don't argue again me this time? 如果不否认这一点，云山你最能接受我的心意的话，那我很乐意接受这个事实。<laughs> Her pure smile stuck in my heart deeply at this time. Dude, this guy is like the luckiest person in the world. The hell's wrong with you? Although the smile was involved by something, but I recall these things now, and I know I cannot forget anymore. Yet the strange dream is ended with a smile. Oh shit! After waking up, my eyes see the familiar ceiling in my room. At my side is my present lover. She breathes regularly, just like lullaby in the summer, letting me want to fall asleep again. If I have to tell a reason, I fell in love with your serious look when you were studying. However, when the words of the maiden say it's echoing in my mind again, I am not sleeping any longer. Is it in the morning? The dream is ended suddenly. Maybe, perhaps, maybe, probably not for this. Six twenty-five. I look at the clock beside the bed clock. We often wake up around seven or eight o'clock. If the dreams in it, they're not by chance, but for some indication. I'm afraid the answer is maybe I don't want to recall these bad things after that night. Now she is a ghost. It means she's gone. So I can probably guess what happened that night. No matter how the process is, I can assure the last part of the dream that didn't tell us a sad story. But I just don't understand. From the beginning to the end, I never recalled the maiden's name. Not only myself, in a dream, everyone seemed to be ignoring the part of her name. It's almost like someone remembered the maiden's name. Everything would end up. If someone touches the key, the story will be over. Because of this, the maiden threw her name away. Yep, but now you belong to me only. Suddenly, I remember what、uh, Jenshi said at school. That's a natural feeling, but now I realize the word now. She was quite a sudden whatever. 
Yeah, I'm just his boyfriend now. But it's just now. So far in my life, Bao Love is just not owned by Zhen Shen. So actually, I lied to Zhen Shen. I murmured to myself while smoothing, smoothing her hair on her hair. I should tell Zhen Shen the whole story sometime. It must be finished, no matter, uh, no matter for Zhen Shen, for that girl, for myself. Yun Shen. Holy shit! Wait, Yun Shen. Wait, now I'm in juvenile. The hell? After class, the maiden went on a small group which she often gathers and came out to the juvenile like a little hamster with a smile. The juvenile called Yunshan delivered the information, don't close to me, to everyone obviously, but the maiden act, act like she did not notice the atmosphere around him. Wait for the juvenile on the- oh shit, I clicked on space. <sighs> the juvenile had noticed her before saying no, but she chose to ignore her because he put learning in a top priority position. If he could, as a result, in the case of the maiden cannot stop horsing around, the juvenile put aside the tax, gazing on her. Maybe. The efficient of learning will be poor, so if you have nothing to say, please let me study first. When I'm free, I will chat with you. Summer vacation? Oh shit! By the way, is it true? It's the beginning of May by now, at least one month before the vacation. But before that time, just let me... That's true! Hmm. Being rejected to chat, the maiden murmurs to Philly because of some anger and discontent. But her feeling made the juvenile stop his thought, paying attention to the book, and he was choked by the thick pink atmosphere everywhere. Pink atmosphere? You! A few days ago, the maiden, who had good looking as well as cheerful personality, became a focus on one in class. Chatting with juvenile for the reason I love you look looking when you were in study. For then on, there were some changes in him, who had put in study in the first place, although so far this was some changes only for this maiden. Yet even even so, there's few changes that hard to chat briskly. Are you mad? <laughs> Pumping her lip just like a ball, which show her she is definitely angry, but she's never gonna leave. Upon seeing this case, knowing that she's probably wanna chase her and her from herself, Sir Juvenile was shaking in his head helplessly, and then he spoke the answer when he's putting on the book and disc. We made a deal to stay with you for a while. Okay. When the boy promised that he was willing to chat with her, her cheeks puff out like a punctured balloon, returned to usual realm, and the unhappy face was eliminated altogether with it. Then she turned to Juvenile again as lovely as a pet, twisting her head slightly away for the conversation may have. You pretend to get mad just now. The juvenile thought about it while looking at the maiden. Stated beforehand, chatter with me may be very depressed because I have no interest in things except for study. So I don't know anything interesting, but also don't know the interesting speaking style. <laughs> the maiden was smiling sweetly. It's so good if like that, that both of them were, were talking out of class. Actually, most of the time, the maiden expanded the topic, led the topic in topic, and the juvenile just replied some, someone occasionally, but even though the maiden looks very happy. Some of the members of the small group which took her as a center were back to their places, staring at them both poorly. And then for some for so long ago, it's another is a short period before the bell ring for the class. Oh no no what? Thanks for talking a lot during a short time. In some ways it's really cool ability. The maiden is standing up and shaking her head while saying this, and she's back in her seat. Chatting again? We chatted a few, just a few minutes, or should I say, heard a lot of things. 
even though she's he says so, he's looking forward to something in his mind. The average is that he's smiling unconsciously while he's complaining, although it's only a marginal raise. Well, I'm gonna stop right here because it's getting way too long. Um, hoping this this might end pretty soon. I'm gonna save it two. So far, there are any choices going on. So, yeah. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys for your support. And yeah, peace out, guys.